I have mostly recovered from my sickness. Where I Ah, <laughs> oh, my brain. Where am I? Do I want to be down here? Or do I want to be up? Uh Okay. I don't think I can get no the camera's not even moving. Okay. I'll go down. I don't think I needed to go up for that. It says over. Oh no, that okay, that had the barrier. I have fast travel now. Okay, I'm gonna go down. Oh, right! The snake! The snake needed things. The snake needed the Thermodops. But... I wish the adventure log had, like, current objective. <laughs> Is it in here? Uh, Great White Serpent, two Moonlit Dusts, and further purification of the Corrupted Deity to within the Ashen Hinderlands. Okay, so I need to purify that deity. Does the deity have one of the things? That's what I'm not certain about. I got the gold dust from this section here. By like pure whim of running around that area. Uh we're gonna go check. I wanna go see if I can make it past. Got it. Ow. Okay, I'm leaving these fish heads alone. Okay. Wait. Wait a second. I didn't fall... Okay. There's a place I need to fall down on a different area. Okay, fine. Dumb fish heads. Okay. Uh, yeah, I remember you, Snake. I really... Some designs are much nicer than this. This, this one feels kinda... Eh. I do. It's good discussion. Check hole. Go down hole. Prevent slowing down. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, which one do I turn off though? Eh, maybe my range one. I I I hate this. <laughs> ah, I can move normally, and I that's so much better. They're good conversations about JRPGs and some dumb. choices whether in them or in their freaking release schedules <laughs> or in the thing with the yakuza new game plus dlc okay doesn't even damage me it's just annoying <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Come on. Can I roll through it? Okay, I can roll through it. <laughs> I thought you were dead. I kind of assumed you were dead. Ow! 
I forgot. Health bar. Health bar is our thing. Oh shit. I stepped into the gas. I forgot. Uh, fine. Engaging. Okay, yeah, this is out of the mud at least. Yes, I put eyeshadow on it. I'm kind of... Like, the main thing I remember putting was bags under the eyes. <laughs> I feel like I should make them darker. There's a bell right here. Which, huh. Why would there be a bell right here? Run? Um, what? Why did it grow? Is it gonna explode? <laughs> oh, okay! It exploded into things! <laughs> Why? Why though? Why? Hello, Kaho. <laughs> that is. <laughs> I like it. As a little summon thing of a doodle, but. Oh! She struggles. <laughs> She struggles to come to me. <laughs> um... Okay. Money. Something's... Going nuts over there. You were like right out of. Well, these things actually remind me of Giggy. You, you, okay. Push me out of the arena. Okay, I need to fall. Fall to get attacked by fish? None of that. Actually, I realize those things have things. They shouldn't be geese. What were the other things? I'm trying to remember the dumb Kiro. That's what it was. The ones that go on with the um, Malzena. God, just take a leap of faith. I 
more things are to do with the other snake thing. Duh. I figured you two were just too clean. Everything spawned in after. <laughs> so good. Okay. That's not the best. No. Go over. Feel a little empty. Well, okay. Okay. Okay, I hear it. A little maze, but now I'm further from it. What? Okay, I see it. Oh, it's like a oh, it is just a little maze. Damn it! <laughs> Ow! Okay, they're screaming. Can't hurt me. I need to find my way around. Okay, good. I can hit them through the wall. Okay. How many is that, actually? 20. I think there's 30. So that actually is so many off from being the full amount. Okay, there's another secret on the upper half, though. Okay, I can't get up through that way. This one? Okay. Um... Fortunately, with it being so dark, I can't see shit! I don't see anything that would be one of the question mark things. Smack some walls. Smack. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I'll get another light grate to make... Wait. Aha! What are you? A uh, human, eh? Uh, I can't let you roam around, demon. Ah, spare me, please. I lovely human. What? Please, you have to believe me. I am good boy. What? <laughs> I'll give you a gift for some 20 lunar crystals. How is that a gift if I'm paying? <laughs> I have not had the chance to play some of those. <laughs> uh, except the trade. 
Sacrifice 1% of your max health. I couldn't even read it. Wait, uh, sacrifice one French. 1% of your max health to send a strong brain slash from melee attacks. 1% isn't a lot. Curious. So where's the horde that's gonna come out now? Nothing? Really? Bullshit. Oh wait. Damn it, it's on the other side. I heard it. And I didn't fully look for it. It's just not enough damage, apparently. Okay. Ugh. Now I can get around. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This loops back. Ow. Shit. gives the lever. So now there is a shortcut. Basically a giant loop. mean that I might be closer to that thing because there's nowhere else to go. Yeah, nowhere else to go. I had to check the map. <laughs> to make sure I wasn't missing a doorway. Okay, shit. I'm about to kill myself just from this. No! Yep. Freaking gas. Glad I hit the bell. Even though I would have respawned it there anyway. Actually, no, I wouldn't have. I would have respawned at the one pass. Oh, what got me to play this one? 
I played the previous Momodora. Momodora under the Riviere Moonlight? So that's why this one was already on my radar. I was in... At, I played the previous one a while back. I don't even remember when exactly. But... I replayed it before playing this on uh, stream, but... Come on. I'm not getting this jump right, and I'm gonna get hit by these stupid spore things on my way up. <sighs> but it was just a short little four hour indie. Or, yeah, probably indie. And enjoyed it. I think I was just in a sort of side scrolling Metroidvania ish mood when I originally played it. And enjoyed it enough to try this one. I. There isn't a fall from above. So, how. Is it really. Is there another jump tactic? Because. Oi! I am not latching onto the wall as well as I would like. Okay. <gasps> yes! Okay, glad I came here. Power-ups are a very good thing to grit. Especially if I think I'm about to hit a boss. I don't think this one entirely labels itself as Metroidvania, but it definitely has the Metroid vibe. <laughs> the nice part... I wonder if there would be a dash, but... The previous one says, like, four hours, and when I re when I looked at my old file and replayed it, the four hours seems about right. So... Though, I know this one's gonna be longer, because it's already been longer. <sighs> okay. Honestly, I'm fine dying. <laughs> uh, easier than having to run it. My ball jump game is not strong. I hear things. Ah, oh, the tainted serpent. Yes, this is a bus. Hi. Yes, this. Get rid of the things. Okay, get rid of things. Oi! Are you gonna stop again? Oh, hi. <gasps> ah! <laughs> You're a more interesting design than the other one! Probably because you're a boss. Me 
goes fast. Not sure if that does anything. <laughs> Destroying the orbs. Didn't seem to. Yeah, I can't really hit them. I thank you for being consistent to this side, though I don't think it'll be that day forever. <laughs> Probably just shoot an arrow at it. Nope, still does some damage. Okay. Well, maybe not as much as it could have. You're being very consistent. Mm. I hope you stay that way, but at the same time, I don't trust it. just focus on doing head damage and not worrying about the little orb things. At least not as many of them. Oh wait, he's gonna be here. Oh, he's doing something different. At least that was one difference. Why is there an orb? Okay, good. <laughs> while trying to hit that head. No, this is not the whole. There is a early access game that I have been waiting on that... Oh, uh, what? I want to say it's Genshyokyo Night Festival. That, at least when I originally looked at it, reminded me of Momodora style. However, with time, it when I recently looked at it, it does not look as Momodora as it used to. I think it has a bit more of a Tohel elements than it had before. Which is good. It should have more like bullet hell aspects for
That one I'm waiting for it to get out of early access. I, I don't even like playing games or even buying them in early access. I do for very few. Shit, I should have paid more attention to my health. It definitely makes sense, I guess, to some degree. It helps fund the development, but... And I know, like, Baldur's Gate didn't... That's certainly a game I enjoyed a lot of, so it's not like I can complain too much, but... I think there are still some concerns with... non-trusted studios. It's kind of... It's a dice roll. <laughs> In almost every respect. Uh, prevent stamina depletion. Damage taken from enemies is greatly increased. Prevent stamina decreasing. remember but I want I can't remember if it was released early access but wasn't there some game that released and then within like a day or so immediately got taken off steam like there's something in between okay how do I get there though I don't know how I get there. I just, yeah, I, like, it's a vague memory. I want to say it was some sort of shooter thing. Shit, I wonder if I can actually look it up, because I am just going to, like, bog my brain if I don't. Oh, the day before. That's the one. I don't remember if that one was early access, though. Okay, I feel like I can, but can I? <laughs> At least I remember the name of it. I can probably go reread or rewatch some of the videos on it. If I'm so inclined. I mean, current early access controversy is Pal World, which I am definitely choosing not to play personally. Just because it... Granted, I probably wouldn't have played it even for the most part. Because I'm not even a fan of survival games too much, so... I almost had it shit. And I don't even know if it's anything worth going for. <gasps> I got it. <laughs> Get me out of here. Ah. <laughs> oh, an egg. And a power-up. And now another jump puzzle. <laughs> with platforms. I think I need to turn down the sensor <laughs> for the auto mod. Wait. Oh, and I don't think I can make that. I'll get into that later. Okay, I wonder if I go to the serpent. If that will just give me the other one or I still need to go find that one I might still need to go find that one <sighs> the other dust 
gonna go talk to them first, so, because, hey, I killed that one. I, I killed the boss you wanted me to. They were better designed than you. Also smaller, <laughs> I realize. Uh, to perform the ritual, I need a golden moonlit dust and silver moonlit dust to return to me then. Okay, so I still need to go find a silver. Ha. Huh. But where? <sighs> where else could I go? Okay. The... Uh, no, the Demon Frontier places were blocked by wind. And I'm not getting the... Break through the wind... Stuff until... I do this ritual. It might be in the same place as the gold, though. There are still a bunch of question marks there, so I may have just missed it. And it would make some sense? Maybe? Okay, the snake's not giving me any answers. Maybe... I go talk to the village matriarch? And or talk to the fairy? Queen person? That seemed like something to do. Like, the game not outright telling me is fine. Because I can stumble into some on my own just from looking at the question marks, but having a little bit more direction of hey, look here. Or even maybe the major arc will only tell me about. There should be one in the old sanctuary place that I already looked, and maybe the fairy goddess will tell me I might have another one. Uh, well, that was a bust. <laughs> Where were you saying? Uh, fair spring, something tells me couldn't have found it in there. Like, I'm wondering if that quest is important? Slash will give me the thing as reward. Might be hidden. Could be hidden. But it doesn't help when the hint is just the springs. Because that's this entire section of blue. That's where it came through on. Ah. Okay, that was secret. something oh my god I did miss something okay how did I miss you were you just not here you might not have been here okay I need to hit your face but your face is also danger Drop the item I need? Bloodstained Pendant! I think that's it! He wanted a pendant!
wandering randomly into a corner of the map. Damn it. Yes, I found your pendant. I've returned. Myrtle. Young lady, did you find the pendant? Should I give him the pendant I found? Y yes? I did find the pendant. Here it is. Ah. Uh, hola, my brother. So you're gone. I'm sorry. It's not your fault, young priestess. Thank you for bringing me the pendant. Please, take this. Thank you, and I hope you'll find the strength to deal with your loss. Fairy icon. Uh, the statue is a relic that perm eh, permanently amplifies the effect of the healing bell, making it damage nearby foes. Oh! That's not too bad. So now when I heal, it will actually hurt enemies. This still leaves me in a, like, where the freak is the damn silver dust? Is it that question mark? Is it really that one? Or hell, maybe it's that. No, it can't be that one. That one, that one is the flower that I do not feel capable of reaching. I assume this ritual is going to give me a dash, and I think that dash will make that much more possible. Okay, that was like right in the way for it. Goddamn. Even just hitting you seems like a pain in the ass. I feel like I'm in something. Oh, I found it. That's still not what I was hoping for. <laughs> <sighs> Might be the time to tap, because... Uh, Momodoro, Moonlit, Farewell. Uh, Silver, Moonlit Dust. I don't... Where can I find Silver Moonlit Dust? Just give me simple answers. In the Lun Tree Zone, right side of the map. Ha. Huh. Lun Tree is here. Oh, I see. I did miss a section. That might be it. Um, based on where I'm seeing that opening now, this is actually the closer travel point. Okay. Nope. Okay. I need that other sigil. Where'd it go? This one. Okay. Oh, right. This was a thing I needed double jump for. But also. Ah, uh, yes, I see it. It's glowy. Oh, that's the add new train spot. Well. I was hopeful. And at least partially dashed. But maybe further down. Oh, there's a hole. Maybe in the hole? 
Destroy every lunar crystal of Prosotiri in one save. Well, that definitely tells me that this is probably close to over. Like, there probably ain't too much more. Yep, how do I... Booster. Ooh. I need a power boost. <laughs> okay. I, my jump is not strong enough. Barely hitting this wall. I'll go in here. Moonlit repose. This seems like a proper... <laughs> Definitely similar to that other... So boss. So boss. Okay, not boss. Horde. Okay. Not too bad. I expected boss, so it could have been worse. Huh. This is using a bit more of that... Oh, this might be a rush. Oh, read. Uh, in this lab lay the history of our world as told by the White Sage of Ishlith. That long ago, two moons lived in the ocean of stars, one in the image of the perfect beauty and one in the image of alluring darkness. The two siblings, sibling moons, too, existed peacefully for a long time. Okay, no, that... So you're gonna have slow orbs and have me fight a bunch of things? Oh, good lord! That kind of thing. I wanna fight that thing. Ow. Oh god, that is so take. You have to hit them, hit them. Oh, you're still alive. Sorry, missed you. Can the orb things go away? <laughs> Flower. Uh, the smaller moon, Salen, eventually grew envious of the larger one's light. He desired the grace he lacked. Commanding darkness, the small moon fought with the large moon. Huh. 
how many levels this is gonna be. <laughs> No! I hate dealing with Lucas. are still my most feared enemy. They shouldn't be, because I'm from Maryland. <laughs> uh, their battle rage on display, their blood spilling down our earth. The conflict only ceased when the small moon took an eye out of the large moon. After stealing the eye, the small moon grew to shine as well. Slow thing over here again, so I can deal with this one properly. <laughs> of fate did not approve of the moon's quarrel. To prevent further destruction, the two moons were put into a deep slumber. Before her sleep, the large moon gave our people a gift. The lendry, or would it be the bells themselves? Be gone, trespasser. Your presence is not allowed here. Ow! I don't like having to jump to hit you! Ow. Well, that reminds me of the last boss of the last game. That's nice. If I can pick it up, that'd be nicer. isn't necessarily hard, it's just tedious. To 
because there's not enough air combo. Which would be a complaint, and I think a bit of a downgrade. Do I feel like they had more? But it was a bit more freedom. Yeah. Okay. okay. Right here again. If anything, that Black Bell fight was, ow, probably the best one so far? Uh, Phantasm Blade, when dealing melee damage to enemies, sometimes powerful magic blades will appear to aid you. I thought I had that one. <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> 